This is Clint Buckley with ETSN. I'm here with White House head football coach Marcus Gold after his team's 37 to 6 win over Chapel Hill. Coach, congratulations on the win. Uh, what were some of the positives you saw? I, I would imagine you have to start with your defense, right? Uh, yeah, they, I think they, they just the effort. And you know, there's two things I told them they can control: is their effort and their attitude. And I thought they had pos positive body language all night. Uh, Chapel Hill did a good job at times where they were moving the ball down the field. They were getting into our red zone, and our our kids showed some grit there and and buckled up and and, and held them on some big third downs. Uh, Michael Robbie, the play of the game, at least in the first half, they were going in for a touchdown. Chapel Hill was right before halftime. He comes up with the pick six. What did you see from the sideline, and, and what kind of read did he make on that play? I, I I have to watch film to tell you that, Reed, but Michael Robbie is a he's a playmaker. He finds a way to get to the football, and it's all about his effort. And, uh, you know, that's two weeks in a row to where the game could have went either way, uh, to where it could have got really close right there at halftime, and uh, our linebackers have come up with a big interception and a touchdown. Offensively, not the big numbers you guys put up last week, but still y'all did enough, and, and uh, you know, especially in the second half, got, got more comfortable. What, what were some of the things that were holding y'all back offensively early in the game? We changed the game plan a little bit. We wanted to tempo a lot more. We did a lot less shifts and motions. Um, it, we didn't change much at halftime, defensively or offensively. Uh, we continued to do, go with the game plan and just, just executed better, and I think they did a better job there in the second half. Uh, Kendall Fry and Kendrian Johnson, uh, two big playmakers for you so far at the beginning of the season. Uh, wh what are you know? What are your thoughts on those two guys, uh, especially uh, Kendrian, the first two games he's had? I think Coach Lev's doing a good job of getting away, getting them the ball because they are playmakers and they're going to make things uh, happen in the open field. Uh, they're special players, they're special talents, and uh, it's going to be important for them to stay healthy throughout the season. All right, you guys got one more non-district game uh, next week against a pretty good Melissa team. Um, what, what's going to be the focus this week as you as you head into your, your last non-district game of the year? I, you know, I just told the kids I'm doing a really bad job, and when the game's over, I'm already looking ahead. So I got I got to enjoy this for a couple couple hours, uh, break down how this game went, and then move on to, to Melissa mid-afternoon tomorrow. All right, Coach Gold, I appreciate it. I appreciate you. Thank you.